Hey guys, hello! My name is Katya and welcome back to my YouTube channel Katya Muay Unicorn. And in today's video, I'm finally gonna show you the best female Muay Thai fights happened in Thailand in November 2020. Yeah, I know, I'm sorry. It really takes me long time to film all those videos, but better late than never right so this is what i'm here for today so yeah i personally watched all female muay thai fights happened in thailand in november and i personally have chosen for you guys the most brutal the best and the most exciting fights happened this month so yeah let's get right to it and the first fight I'm gonna show you guys today happened between two women, Argentinian Daniela Lopez and Thai fighter Nan Hon. Both girls were featured several times, so if you're following my channel and my videos, these girls should be familiar to you guys. So that was Muay Thai Super Champ promotion, normal Muay Thai gloves, and both girls are great fighters, pretty well known in Thailand, and they're fighting pretty much a lot on those promotions like uh, Muay Thai Super Champ and Muay Hardcore. Both fighters have 24 years old and they weighed in at 53 kilograms. So yeah, let's watch the fight finally. นางหงซอซี่ครูวันนี้จะพบกับแฟนที่ครับแรงไม่ต้องพึ่งโรงพยาบาลเดินเข้าหาแต่ทางซ้ายของนางหงครับนางหง starting it tough she is throwing some hardcore punches and daniela answers i look really great punches by nanghong why people say that thais can't punch and that was a quick highlight of the first round so let's enjoy the slow motion repeat Daniela tried to land her famous elbows. And we see that Daniela has blood on her nose, but it's really little, so I guess no problem. So girls get in the clinch and they're falling together. Great high kick by Nanhon. Daniela loses balance and falling. Some elbows exchange. And we see the strong clinch performance by Daniela. And the referee stops fight because there is a blood on Nanhon's face. So we see that she has a cut above her eyebrow. And Daniela gets checked as well. So yeah, she has blood on her nose, and both girls keep fighting. Daniela sweeps Hankon. Look at Nanhon, she looks really angry, really crazy, and uh, yeah, this is exciting, no? So cute. Again, both girls are falling. I can say from my fighting experience that when you get in the clinch and when you fall, it takes so much power of yours. When you get up, you feel like, yeah, it took a lot of power from you. And amazing push kick by Daniela. And she gets to knee Nanhon in the face. She got really a lot of blood at the moment. And referee is counting till eight. So yeah, doctor is checking Nan Hong cut and he says that she can't fight no more. Daniela is really happy and greeting her friends. Congratulations, Daniela. And this is the slow motion repeat of the second and the last round of this fight. I guess that one was the elbow that cut her. Powerful, powerful push kick. And the fight is finished. And 
we have the winner from Argentina, Daniela Lopez. And we are moving, guys, to the second fight, which happened on the same show. Muay Thai Super Champ. And this time, it was encounter between Maria Belen from Netherlands and Pech Darat from one of my favorite countries in the world, Thailand. Let's see what happened, guys. So Maria got 30 years old and her opponent is much younger. Page Darat got only 19. They weighted in at 58 kilograms, so the girls are a little bit bigger. And here is the first round. And we can see that the Thai girl is southpaw, so she's fighting with her right side in front. And for some fighters, it could be really complicated to face southpaw fighters. Let's see if Maria got some troubles with that. Wow, Thai girl got some hands. And Maria, as I can see, specializes at the high kicks in the hat. So the first round was pretty much brutal. Let's watch the repeat. ไปได้เลยครับร่างกายแข็งแรงแข็งแกร่งครับหนีจังหวะแรกกันครับโอ้โหดูสาวไว้ครับครับเพชรดารัฐต้องโดนก่อนเช่นเคยครับแปรครับ
and she is facing one of my favorite Thai fighters, Fasi Ton, which we have seen many times in my previous videos. And yeah, she is one of the most famous fighters in Thailand. Amazing! So the girls are really tall, they weighted in at 60 kilograms and Claudia got 1 meter and 78 centimeters and Pasiton is 8 centimeters smaller, which is really great difference in Muay Thai, it's really hard to fight with this height difference. Pasiton is 24 years old and Claudia is 4 years younger. So yeah, it sounds really, really exciting, let's see what happened. Now. Oh my god, what a six pack Claudia got! And she's really, really, really much taller than Fasiton. So let's see what the type of fighter she is because I have never heard about her and I'm watching her fighting first time. She's trying to punch Fasiton, but Fasiton got great and heavy hands. So she has no problem to answer. So to be honest, Claudia doesn't look very experienced. And she's trying to do something, but she doesn't really look very confident. And those punches really affected Claudia's face. แหลกหนักๆครับอุ้ยดูจังหวะเตะของฟ้าสีทองหิดซ้อเอิงนะครับนี่สิทธิ์ซ้อเอิงนี่คือจากค่ายซอสมหมายนั่นเองครับโอ
And the fight number four, guys. Here we gonna see the Scottish fighter and my friend we used to train together with. Claire Rankin, who is trained out of Phuket Top Team, where I was all my fighting career. And she's facing very famous, amazing Muay Thai fighter and world champion Chom Mani. This girl hasn't fought several years. I guess two years she hasn't got in the ring. She got like a fighting break and this is like her comeback, which happened on the Thai show Muay Thai Super Champ. So yeah, obviously the girls got huge difference in the amount of fights and fighting experience and a lot of respect for Claire that she was not scared to face to accept this fight against really high level and experienced, much more experienced fighter Chomani. Let's see how was that. And here is the first round. We see that Claire is a little bit taller. And yeah, first round Chomani is obviously dominating, throwing a lot of punches, knees and kicks. Claire is trying to wake up, but she looks a little bit slow yet. And here we could see my first Muay Thai trainer, Nin, who made the fighter out of me. The same happened with Claire, who is at the moment training with him. And yeah, just wanted to leave this piece of video to greet my trainer, Nin. Hola, Nin. Kitin Mark, Naka. จังหวะกระแทกหมัดครับ <coughs> And the second round, again, Chomani is getting Claire with her powerful tips. But what I can see, Claire finally woke up and she's trying to get Chomani in the clinch. Chomani, like AK-47, just throwing and throwing her elbows, knees, kicks, punches. Several times already she gets Claire with this push kick. But yeah, in the second round, Claire looked a little bit more active. And the second round is finished. ยังยิ้มหวานอยู่ครับคาเรนคลายจากสกอตแลนด์ครับถูกเกตท็อปทีมอืมปบซ้ายของชอมานีดึงจังหวะครับโยกยั่วครอสตบซ้ายลูกน
So obviously Chomani has won, but all my respect for Claire who faced this opening, who got so huge cut and a lot of blood and she never stopped fighting. She was doing everything she could and yeah, respect and congratulations with this amazing fighting experience. And we got another fight, guys. Again, it's a Muay Thai Super Chem promotion. We're gonna watch fight between fighter from Myanmar. Her name is Nang Tip. And she's gonna face Nam Wan from Thailand, who looks really smiling on her photo and really cute. Girls are small, they weighed in at 49 kilograms, the weight I have never reached in my life. And they got 19 and 18 years old, so they're pretty much equal. The first round of the fight. ครับต้องบู้อย่างเดียวครับมาที่นี่ประเภทจดจกจ้องจ้องนี่แหละครับไม่ว่าหญิงหรือชายครับดูครับหน้าตานารักแต่ว่าดูอาวุธครับ a lot of kicks by both fighters. Amazing push kick by Nam Wan. The Thai girl looks amazingly technical. Oh, and she almost knocked her opponent out with the kick and punch technique. Another body kick and the Myanmar girl is falling. She gets counted by a referee and let's see if she will be able to get up. Yeah, she's standing again because the show must go on. Oh. And that was the first round. Let's see the highlight เข้าล็อกเข้าแก๊ปเลยครับดึงจังหวะ 2 ครับthe Myanmar girl is trying to be aggressive, but the Thai fighter Nam Wan is just so much more technical. <laughs> and another cut for today, guys. It looks like all fights for today are gonna have some females' blood in. Ah, that's not a cut, actually. She got some problems with her eye, and this is serious. Her eye doesn't look good, and this is really dangerous for her health, so obviously the doctor stops the fight in favor of now one from Thailand. ไปกระนาดที่น้ําติ๊บนี่ก็กลับมาลุยแหละนะครับเพราะว่าตัวเองโดนนับไปในยกแรกแหม่มัดขวานี่แหละครับไม่ทราบว่าใช่ที่แต
Rovira isn't landing much in contrast of her tie opening. Some body kicks exchange and amazing punches by Tiger Girl. And again, and again, and again. Okay, Rovira, you got to do something. Amazing and really impressive first round. ครับน้องปลายเล็กสีสวัสดิ์ยิมยิมซ้ายเตะซ้ายครับดึงจังหวะดูครับโอ้โหบัดแม่นเนี่ยก็จับวางจริงๆครับน้องปลายเล็กอ๋อวุฒิได้ก็เริ่มจะมีความมั่นใจเลยครับดูดิเข็นครับโอ้โหเอ็นอ
the Thai girl got cut and when you cut your opponent you get points for that so that was the result congratulations Ravira and this is guys it for today I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you love female Muay Thai as much as I do and don't forget to like my video and subscribe to this channel if you haven't done it yet thanks guys for watching and I'll see you again in my next video bye guys adios